Well, Jonathan, great to have you on board here at Birmingham City. What are your thoughts about the move? Yeah, I'm like I'm really, really happy with the move. Um, I'm a local boy. I used to live like around the corner, so yeah, just excited. I'm ready. Um, ready to start the season. There was a fair bit of competition for you. You, you were quite in demand. So, what what made your mind up to come here? Um, Birmingham City is a good club. Like, it's a great club with um, good fans. And uh, yeah, like I said before, I was a local kid. Grew up around the corner from here, so yeah, just really happy to be here, really. As you mentioned, you, you, you grew up just behind St Andrews, didn't you, I believe? Yeah, yeah, just literally two minutes away, so yeah. And obviously, playing for West Brom as well, you, you knew the club, the locality, you're aware of this club, its stature and so forth. Yeah, yeah, defo. Um, I know Birmingham's a good club. It's got a, a real good fan base. So yeah, I'm always, always on to be here. Must be nice for you to know that the blue supporters are delighted that you're here. Yeah. And on the flip side, Albion fans who believe in your abilities are wishing you well. Yeah, um, West Brom's a good club. I've obviously, I've been there all my career, all throughout my career. So I have nothing but good, say, good things to say about West Brom. But yeah, just really ready to start the next path of my career and kick on. Yeah, I was, I was going to ask them, um, what are the next steps for you? Is this real opportunity to sort of kickstart your career and become a regular and important part of this yeah. team? Yeah, just like you said, just really ready to start kickstart my career. Um, just to be a regular in the team, score all the goals, assists, and yeah, just to have an impact here. Yeah. It must be good after a, a couple of loan moves to get settled again and yeah. to know that you really wanted to help a side achieve things. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's always good to be settled and um, just really happy to be here and to get started, yeah. Let's just quickly talk about the, your last loan to Charlton Athletic. You enjoyed it, you, you made an impact and, and you felt it was a good fit under Lee Boy, didn't you? Uh, yeah, the Lee Boy was really good. He really helped me as a player. And yeah, I really enjoyed my time at Charlton there. Uh, obviously got cut short because of my ACL injury, but really enjoyed it then. Mm. As you mentioned, yeah, you did your ACL in December. That was a, a big blow to you because you were playing well and, and being a regular in the team, weren't you? Mm -hmm, yeah. Uh, yeah, it was just a bit of a, a bit unlucky, so just really ready to start again and, um, and go again, yeah. yeah. How has the rehabilitation been going um, and what's the sort of programme for you in terms of being out on the grass and up to full speed again? Um, it's been hard because of Covid, I had to do it on my own, I had to do it in the garage on my own, <laughs> most of my rehab, so it's been tough. but. Um, it's made me stronger and uh, just really ready to go. And in terms of coming back, I'm, um, I think I've still got like a, a month left to go. So just get back slowly and get back fit. Yeah, you mentioned there you, you're just in your garage, just sort of working out and having yeah. to do stuff on your own. How, how difficult is that? Because obviously you couldn't get access to the Albion training ground due to the lockdown and, and coronavirus. Yeah, yeah, because of COVID, literally I had to go in my garage FaceTime my physio while I'm doing all my um, strength and conditioning stuff. So it's really hard because no one's really there. So you're just there on your own doing it. But I think it helped me mentality wise, made me stronger. So, yeah. We know you can play up front, wide, across the three. Yeah. Um, I guess you can give the manager, the head coach, uh, a lot of attacking versatility. Yeah, I, I play all across the front three. So I'm. Um, very quick, strong, so uh, yeah, just ready to go. Yeah. I was going to ask you how would you describe yourself as a player you, you've just told us then, those are your attributes? Yeah, I would say I'm very quick, I'm strong, I'm skillful, yeah, those are my attributes, I would say, yeah. <laughs> and Ator Kranka, the head coach, was he a factor in you coming here as well? Yeah, definitely, I spoke to him on the phone. And uh, he was just telling me how much he wanted me and how much he wanted me to come to this club. So, yeah, he, he was a big factor, yeah, definitely. Yeah, that, that's good to hear. And yeah. what will he be expecting of you? How will he be looking for you to contribute? Yeah, he would just want me to play loads of game, be an impact, uh, score loads of goals and assist. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Finally, Jonathan, um, what would your message be to all the Birmingham City supporters out there? Um, I'm really excited and um, I'm ready for you lot to come watch me play and hopefully I can be good for you this season. Yeah. <laughs>